Hey everyone, it's Adrienne Mitford here from Do Life BU, and today I'm going to show you how to import email addresses from a spreadsheet into your Flowdesk system. So we're going to go ahead up here to Audience, and I have a choice of subscribers or segments. So we're gonna go into all subscribers, and now I can either add a subscriber, which is individually putting their email address, first name, last name, and choosing a segment or a portion of that audience that they're going to be a part of. I could do that for each individual email address. So if you only have a handful to get started, you might want to consider that. Otherwise, you can upload a CSV file. So we're going to go ahead and do that. So click on Upload CSV File, and this can be any CSV file that you have saved on your computer. If you're not sure what a CSV file file is. It's a file that you make in Excel. You're going to have each data field in a separate column. So first name in one column, last name in another column, email address in a third column. And if you have any other identifying information, you can pull some of that in too. I'm going to go ahead and click open and that's going to pull up two columns. On the left hand side here we have the CSV data. On the right hand side choose a flow desk field. So I want to make sure I'm matching up those fields. So we're going to go ahead and match the first name, the last name, and it's already recognized the email address. And then I'll simply say continue. If you're not sure on the CSV file, if you save an Excel spreadsheet, so you do save as, and it will ask you what type of file you want to, you want to select, you can scroll down and select CSV. Um, so once you have a file that is a CSV file, that's how you set this up. I'm gonna go ahead and just add these to the segment test and then say continue. And so now the CSV with my two email addresses has been successfully uploaded. The system will send me an email saying that that's been processed. It's clearly gonna happen right away because there's only two subscribers on it. If you had a list of hundreds or thousands of people, it might take a little bit of time. And when that was processed, they would send you an email. And then we're going to select finish. And now those people have been added into my full subscriber list as well as into my test segment list. So I hope that helps to answer questions and how to add multiple subscribers to your Flowdesk account. And if you have any further questions, please reach out to me at dolifebu.com. Thank you.